two, ready, go. Okay, so I'm going to break this down into little pieces. The first part, what I want to say, a couple things, is that first of all, this is written in the key of C. But I'm playing it up here, and then your homework is to transpose it to different parts of the fretboard. So, uh, I'm doing it in the key of E. First thing I want to do is say that a lot of these finger shapes are around the C shape. In other words, here's a C, here's a C chord. You know, you use two, three, and four instead of one, two, and three, and you shift that up to uh, where your index finger, first finger is on the fourth fret. I'm going to use my second finger on this E right here on the second string. So, it's all part of this shape. All right, it's around a C chord. All right, that would be the first part to get. Okay, now you can either just sort of drop your finger flatter to get to the uh, sixth fret of the uh, the third string. Or you can actually just move your fingertip like that, but again from the beginning, ready, go, and all right. Now that's the first part. And my hand basically is gonna stay in second position right here. So again from the beginning, ready, go, and that's the that's that E flat uh, or D sharp rather. In the key of E, D sharp. You can play it over here if you want to, but I'd like to just kind of reach my first finger down. Now you're going to be at the seventh fret now of um, the uh, third string, and that's a, that's a D. Sorry, I made a mistake there. So that's seven, six, four. All right, from there, you're gonna just drop your first finger down to the first string fourth fret and play this this G sharp right here. But I don't I don't do this. I don't move my fingertip all the way down. I just, I just flatten my finger out, and I get that that G sharp right here, the fourth fret. Okay. So again, in the beginning, two, slowly here and. All right. Then from this G sharp, I play that B, seventh fret. Uh, sorry, <laughs> looking at the screen backwards here, B to C sharp, and then I play the fifth fret, A, B, and then go back to the G sharp, and that's the E, F sharp, D sharp, all right, so that's really kind of the first part of the cycle. Ready, go, and... And then that repeats. Okay. 
Then you're going to go to this B, a 7th fret, first string, and then go down chromatically to A, and then reach for this G, and then slide up to the right. Then you're going to reach for this E here. Now I suppose you could do it that way if you wanted to. But I like to kind of use the fretted strings, uh, notes rather. So that's going to be C sharp, E, F sharp. Now this is a good little exercise for 2, 3, and 4. Uh, I, I suppose you could go... do that but I use my pinky okay so let's do that again ready go and now it's gonna do that twice right and then you're gonna reach all the way up at the 12th fret here and get that E. And then goes back to B again, down chromatically. Now from this F sharp, G, F sharp, E. Now from this point, you're going to go from E to F sharp to G sharp, C sharp, B, and the whole thing repeats. Watch that over and over again, and you'll be ready to go. Et cetera, et cetera. Have fun.